Hello, I am Ice Beast, and welcome back to Crusader Kings 2. Uh, let's take care of business right away. We have died, obviously. Um, we died at the very end of our last war. Uh, and we want to quickly take care of this extra piece of land we have. I'm going to give it to um, Guerre here. Don't want to give it to the ambitious guy. Don't want to give it to the guy who's already part of a dynasty. So congratulations, Guerre. You are been granted some land. Next thing we're going to do is uh, do some raiding, I think. Uh, so let's do that right away. Um, we want to raid because we need prestige. We need prestige to not lose to these guys if they declare war on us so that we can actually summon an army of greatness. So that's, that's basically what's going on here. The prestige is going to be really important. So you guys get on the boats. We'll immediately we'll start by uh, raiding uh, these guys right here because they border us, and therefore we get the the money and prestige instantly. And also, it will recharge quickly, which will be good. So yeah, we should. This should all just immediately be going. See, our prestige is going up instantly here, which is really good. Praise Odin. Sweet. So we'll let this happen quickly. As soon as we get to 500 prestige, we'll be in a much, much, much better spot. So we'll come down to here next. Are we leading this army? Yeah, we are. And we have, uh, we have quick mover or whatever it is. Uh, speaking of which, let's see, can we find any, um, anybody that wants to come to our court? about this guy? Why can't I invite you to court? Oh, because you're already my steward. This is my marshal. Um, yeah, so none of these guys are going to want to come to court because they don't like me. What about, um... What about other people? What about you? No. 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 All right, next thing. Let's look at this guy. How close is he? Not close. 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 This guy's an heir, so he's definitely... Um, if I send him a gift, he might come. Still no, even though seven is greater than six. Which sucks, because I'd really like to get this guy to come to our court. I'm letting this move forward, hoping that it would, you know, tick up. It won't. It's too bad. Um, do need to watch this, though. Oh, we're out of money here. Let's get on back on the boats. Other things to consider. How did we lose prestige? How did I just lose a bunch of prestige? I thought I had, was at like 380. Maybe I just misremembering, but I swear I was at 380. Uh, I do want this guy actually to improve diplomatic relations, not so descent. Yeah, he's still doing the wrong thing. There we go. I want to do that because I don't want to get caught, basically. Um. So that should be good. We'll get some we'll get some loot here. These guys are going the other direction. So that's good. I got a little bit of a something in my my throat right now, which I, I might be sounding a little odd. I apologize for that. <clears throat> Maybe that will uh, clear it out a little bit. This is not our son, so he could be cruel. I'm gonna leave now just to be safe. Um, and then we'll come on over to here. Could probably raid Kent. No, nope, they have uh, an army up. Can we raid Suffolk? Nothing to raid. Let's come over to uh, to over here and see if there's anything to raid. Oh, my wife's pregnant. Hopefully, it's not a son. So there's these 434 guys. We're just gonna let them sit there for now. 
as we uh, get some more loot. Good, 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 good. 50 loot is good. Okay, let's get on these boats. See, we're just going to keep on moving along the coast here. We'll hit uh, this next, maybe. Um, looks like somebody's already there. Don't want to go against uh, Zeeland here. Let's throw the fiend in the dungeon. We'll raid Suffolk. Nothing to raid in, in I mean Norfolk. There's nothing to raid in Suffolk. Doing good. We got a uh, 62 gold already. Oh, good. Helmark has uh, has should have converted to Norse, right? Fuck yeah. Catholic, Irish, 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 Irish. How goes the uh, rating? Slow but steady. But we should be. We're getting into a good position where we'll be able to. Um, be able to get a lot of gold. And that's that's something I'm looking forward to here. I should be able to raid you without upsetting West Francia. So that's what I'm gonna do. I just have to watch this army, which is crushing this Frankish army. But we're really close to a hundred gold. You're going to Artois. Interesting. Um, we're going to get the fuck out. It's going to be really close, actually. Hopefully we escape. God damn it, we didn't fucking escape. That is such bullshit. We should have escaped there. I want to get on the boats. I really don't want to be here. I had another fucking son. Lost way too many dudes in that stupid fight. That I should have been able to escape from, but I missed by by a roll of the dice. I don't actually know how it decides when people are supposed to be at the same place at the same time who wins. Because half the time I seem to win, and half the time I seem to lose. Um. So we'll get you back on the boats. All right, and this guy just declared war on me, which is is kind of expected. Uh, I need the money again still. Uh, what I need to do... Oh, god damn it. We're gonna lose these guys. I can't get... Oh, and the... I fucking paused the game! That's such bullshit. Now they're gonna definitely get there in time. Oh, I'm so pissed off about this. I'm gonna lose 500 fucking dudes that I can't do shit about now. Oh, I'm so mad. Why did he go that fucking way? Yeah, we need to raise, um... Oh, just... God damn it. At least run away and see if he can escape. So pissed off right now. Very, very pissed off right now. Oh, and I lost the entire army. Well, we have enough prestige, so that's good at least. Yeah, form up here, form form of a of a Batman or something like that. Um, next thing we're gonna do is raise a tribal army. How come I don't have all my dudes with me? And where are these boats? So you guys go up to here, merge. What the fuck's going on with these boats? <laughs> Thank you. So, 22 of you. You come up here to pick up these guys. 10 of you. You continue to pick up those guys. You merge. You get on the remaining boats. Okay. You come on down to here. Oh, your toggle does a looter. But, yeah, I'm probably fucked. And that sucks. That really sucks. Oh, I've apparently inherited this from that guy. He just died. Um. 
Find characters. Search realm. Congratulations. God, you're all fucking of the same family. Why, what's up with this goddamn family? This guy's old. You know what? He's fucking old. Let's make him the chief of Tyrconnell. Okay. Not enough boats. Are you fucking kidding me? Get up there already. What happened to merging? Thank you. Did he become grave? No one will know. Okay, so you get on the boats. That's 3,600 dudes. So we'll have about 5,000 dudes. Um, hopefully, I mean, the big thing that they have is a huge heavy cavalry advantage. We want them to win some sieges because it causes them to lose dudes. Um, so I think that that's definitely what we want to have happen. I'm gonna lower these boats. Hey look, some more dudes showed up. Cool, so now we have 6,000 dudes. Um, thrower in prison. I have increased my grasp of stewardship. So we'll come up to here. I'm gonna lower these boats as well, we don't need them. So this should clear out very quickly. Five, five turns, basically. And they should continue to lose men as they put these sieges down. So unhappy that I lost those 500 guys. Oh, they won their siege there. That's good. This is a decent place to defend because it is a, a hills piece of land. Those are all plains up there. Fortunately, I did drop off some random dudes for no reason. So, yep, now we'll chill here. Let them win another siege and drop off some dudes. And figure out where they're going next, which is Oriole. Should be very easy to win this back this siege. Where are you going? Now you're going to Brifney? Are you gonna make it in time? 19th of January? You are gonna make it in time, okay. Hoping we're hoping disease and the like hit these guys. That's basically what we're hoping for. We need some good, some good rolls against these guys. Nah, we'll chill here. We'll chill here for a little bit. Yep, so he took the Siege of Canacht. He'll take that very quickly as well. Oh, but they just lost a bunch of dudes. Basically, that's what we're hoping for, is that they continue to lose a bunch of dudes to events. Alright, so we'll come back to here. They'll attack Brifni. We'll retake Canacht. Unfortunately, it will take two, um... Two cycles. I mean, two, two, three cycles. It should have only taken two cycles is what I wanted. But that's okay. We can always convert to the attacker's religion if need be. I don't really want to become Catholic. But if we have to, we have to. Uh, this gains me one diplomacy, which I like. Cool. We're basically just continuing to reset this. Which is fine, and they continue to lose guys, which is what we need. We need them to get their heavy cavalry and heavy infantry numbers down. Um, once they get low enough, we can crush them, and then once we crush them, they're no longer a threat to us. We have more than enough money to afford this army for a while. Um, just can't create Ireland, because I don't have enough piety. No, I could become charitable. Out of curiosity, if I won this... I get 
A bunch of piety and prestige. Cool. Now where are you going? You're probably going to go down to Vesta Fjorder. That's fine. The more dudes they lose, the better off we become. We can get them to down to... Uh, we can get them down to, you know, like uh, 3,200 men. That'd be even better. So why are we at minus 22? Because we lost that one battle, the battle of the 500 dudes. All right, we're going to move in on a brief knee here. How long? Eh, I don't actually want to be sieging brief knee. Because I don't want to have the, the same thing that I'm trying to do to them happen to me. Once this army gets down to about 3,000, I think we'll be in a position that we can actually start attacking it. But again, that heavy cavalry is going to be a serious problem for us. But yeah, they're going to keep having to, to win these sieges that we're going to keep um, defeating. And that's, that's all good, I think. I think we can win this indefinitely. 20th of February. 25th of February. Okay. You gonna get the fuck out of there in time? No, you're not. Okay, that got that got them to stop, which is what we wanted, because we didn't want to lose those those four hundred dudes. And we just need these guys to suffer for a couple more negative rolls. Maybe get down to three thousand or so. What is this? Hills. We don't want to fight there. We only want to fight on plains. But there's a river crossing here. Um, so he's a 19. This is my current chancellor. He's a 12. He loves us. Uh, so I now have a new chancellor. This guy's not going to love us as much, but that's okay. He still loves us pretty well. We can make these guys love us more. This should end this. Cool. We want to invest in light infantry because it's the bulk of our goddamn army. And we should invest in probably... I actually don't know what to invest in in that other category. I'll think about it in a second. Now they're heading to... Is Oriel is plains as well. So if they're heading to Oriel, we might fight them there. I think we're going to fight it out in Oriel. Not quite sure why these this army doesn't follow us, but now they're following us. God damn it. Okay, I guess we're gonna fight it out. Let's make sure we have the right people leading this army. Uh first, can I get anybody better? Do I have anybody better to give commanders to? I mean look at how bad this guy is. Alright. Porfin, you're not horrible. You, you're you're also okay. You're a little better, even though you're a goddamn confused warrior. So then we'll give Porfin here. Can we uh, auto-balance this a little bit better? Um, we should definitely... Come on. Now we're going to put the Icelandic company back on the right. Actually, what I want to do... Just put the Icelandic company in the center. No, not. God damn it. You stay there. You go there. Okay. And we'll put 1,400 dudes over here. I keep fucking this shit up with the goddamn Icelandic company. There we go. Then we'll put um, Alfer on this one. Where's the other guy? Where's the other guy? Oh, is he... I don't know. It's one of these. It's this guy. I currently have uh, settling tribes. Um, I'm going to recall him and put him here because I do want his morale damage bonus. And now we're going in on it, guys. This is going to be a battle. 
Come on, get these extra 435 dudes. That's what I wanted to see, an additional 435. Beautiful, we won the battle. We carried the day. This is my ward, not my son. We want to make him content if possible. Did we crush that army completely? Is that the end of that army? If that's the end of that army, this is we're in a great spot. Because now we don't need to uh, have any of these people uh, leading troops anymore. We can have our marshal continue to settling tribe in Oriel. This is great, guys. This is great. Uh, and this is a good time to end this episode. So thank you guys very much for watching. I hope you enjoyed it. I realized it was a little bit of a slower episode because most of it was centered around this war. But this war is now won and we don't have to worry about those bastards anymore. So that's going to be great. With that all being said, I thank you very much for watching. I hope you've enjoyed it, and I will see you all next time.